Facebook and Microsoft are now being allowed to disclose just how often the U.S. government requests online data. Facebook says that it got up to 10,000 requests in the last half of 2012, targeting some 19,000 consumer accounts. Microsoft got about 6,000 requests. In a statement posted to the company's blog, Facebook says, These requests run the gamut, from things like a local sheriff trying to find a missing child, to a federal marshal tracking a fugitive, to a police department investigating an assault, to a national security official investigating a terrorist threat. Microsoft released a similar statement pointing out the data requests only impact a tiny fraction of Microsoft's global customer base. The two companies explain legally they can't reveal how many data requests were regarding national security, but the majority of government requests were for other things such as local criminal cases. Business Week explains the company's disclosures come after Google asked the U.S. government for more leeway this week to report aggregate numbers of data requests following reports that the U.S. National Security Agency is collecting millions of residents' telephone records and the web communications of foreigners under court order. The New York Times notes under federal law, companies generally cannot disclose even the existence of national security data requests they receive. But in recent days, Facebook, Google and Microsoft have been pressing the government for permission to share more information. The tech giants say the latest information they've been allowed to publish is a step in the right direction. But that laws in place still keep the public from fully understanding the extent of government data requests. For Newsy, I'm Candace Aviles, multiple sources, a broader view.